And that's just the bottom line to that. Like, yo, step your breeding programs up. And what you do is in the street, you need to step your breeding programs up. Because it ain't about you trying to make some money no more. If you ain't got that paperwork and that paperwork ain't proper, don't buy the dog from the dude. The dude asks him more than a thousand, you leave them puppies right there. Or some real stuff. Leave them there. Don't purchase them. I'm telling you that. The dude don't have no OFA papers to say that he's screen, health screening his dogs. Leave them puppies there. Stop picking up puppies and thinking you know how to pick a dog, because you don't. Unless you get into a real dog, man, to show you how. That's a skill. That don't come overnight. Sometimes you might get lucky, and a lot of times you won't. And you'll get a dog with a crummy temperament, because, a lot, again, dudes are just mismatching, or even breeding the bad horses, so because everybody doesn't breed good dogs. All of us. We... All the puppies in the litter don't come out good. You're going to have to call one or two. A lot of us don't call at all. We sell them all. Bad temperament and everything. That's the dog in your house. That's the dog that's wilding out. It's not doing what it's pro properly supposed to be doing. Due to the fact of the temperament. Causal temperament is varying. And now... The dogs used to wouldn't look for trouble, but wasn't scared to engage in combat if it was challenged. I challenge a call, so this shit is jumping over the fence. What kind of stuff is that? Like, yo, like a hundred pound dog jumping over a fence, trying to run away, not trying to face the adversary. That's dangerous. Corso is not supposed to be a lap dog at all. Very detrimental to your household. And then the fair biter, that really doesn't want to engage, but I engage because I'm scared of you, so I'm going to bite the hell out of you. Dangerous aspect. Very dangerous. Oh, that dog is super hot. That dog should be shot and not in cold. Like, take it to the ASPCA, put it down immediately. That's not Corso's behavior, yo. That's not the Corso's behavior. On some real stuff. On some real stuff. Corso's not meant to be no yappity yap. No, 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 no. It doesn't work like that. So therefore, like I said, step your breeding programs up. Do the right thing by the breed. Learn the history aspect. They got a lot of documentaries and forums, foreign forums, that you can translate in English, that you can get a lot of information from. And you can go from there. And again, what Bruno Flavio was saying, one of the foundation breeders, and he's a veterinarian. Like I said, some things I agree with, other things I don't agree with him. But on the aspect of where he got his information from, was going to the museums, seeing the paintings, and looking at old photographs. And you have to do the same thing too. I would advise that. Talk to real enthusiasts, people you don't, like the people that you do like and if everybody comes up with a with a common ground for the same it's all basically saying the same thing then that's to be the truth and anything that varies then you gotta like distinguish and find out the truth like it is what it is and the truth would, 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 would definitely manifest itself because again whatever's going in the breed will be manifested in the breed like on some real stuff so some foreign stuff is going in there it's going to be manifested like on some real stuff. So people are watching, and that's that. Corso's in bad shape. Corso could be in better shape, like on some real stuff, but everybody gotta pull together. Stop with this division stuff, pointing fingers and all that, because at the end of the day, it's all about money. It's not about the breed, it's not about the love of the breed. I wish a lot of you enthusiasts stop saying that, because it's not. It's not, every time I turn around, but nobody, like I said, is addressing serious issues in the breed. That epilepsy situation is serious. You're going to mess around and somebody's kid is going to get hurt. Um, a lot of these consoles are funneling like crazy. ASPCA, them type of dog pounds. So that at the end of the day, you got to do what you got to do. But all right, inshallah, you have a pleasant night. Saladin Salam, peace and blessings, and I'm out.
All right, later.